What's up, Facebookers? It's Titty Tuesday. It's Titty Tuesday. It's Quarantine Titty Tuesday. <laughs> ah, just kidding. Uh, Y'all ain't gonna get me banned on here. Fuck no. I'm just sitting outside. It's another fucking beautiful day. Mm -hmm. Drinking my hot tea, about to wake and bake. It's like, wow. It's so pretty today. It's so pretty. On Facebook, it's ugly, but outside, it's really pretty. Yes, yes. I can't stand y'all. I still can't stand y'all. Period is over, but I still can't stand y'all. What's up? Hello, Mr. Jones. I see there's 11 people, but it only says, you know, one person right now. But. Oh my god. Some of you, oh my god. How y'all doing out there in in a quarantine land? How y'all doing in quarantine land? I see. Hello, hello, Igor. Hello, Jean. Hello, hello. Oh. I know some of you are still working. At least some of you are still working. Lord. Y'all ain't never happy on Facebook. Y'all ain't never happy, right? First, you complain that Trump wants to be open by Easter. Oh my God, he's trying to kill us. He's trying to kill us. Oh my God, he's trying to kill us. Look at that, he wants to be open by Easter. He's trying to kill us. <laughs> then they extend it to the 30th. Oh my God, y'all still crying. Oh my God, another month of quarantine. Oh my God, oh my God. So which fucking is it? Which is it? Which is it? Were you mad that we were going to be open by Easter? Are you mad that we're not going to be open by Easter? Which fucking is it, you fucking crybabies? Oh my god. I cannot believe it. That's good. I'm glad you're well. Oh, y'all are so silly. So silly. You're so distracted by Trump. You're so distracted by Trump. You're so distracted by Trump. Some of you acting like you didn't know who Trump was before he, he set, stepped into office. Like, y'all are so distracted by this man that it's, it's funny, but it's, it's also sad how distracted you are by him. You're fucking distracted as fuck by this dude. I get to watch the American people be distracted by bullshit y'all distracted by bullshit and y'all miss everything going on y'all so distracted over here oh my god trump trump look what he said oh my god he wants to sign the checks he wants his name on the checks like we didn't know he was an ego-driven individual ay 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 i can't with y'all i can't with y'all why is it even news that he wants to put his name on the checks why is it even news aren't they always yes why is it even news that he wants to put his name on the fucking checks that, that are being sent to us? <laughs> Why is that even fucking news? Are y'all paying attention to what was written in that bill? Surveillance in the name of safety for the virus. More surveillance by the CDC, which also is going to be going through our phones and they're going to be looking through our social media outlets too. Did y'all pay attention? I posted it. Go look in the timeline. This is not conspiracy theory. This is fact, okay? So y'all get your heads out the fucking sand or your asses or wherever your heads are and pay attention. Pay attention. Pay attention while you all distracted about how dumb Trump is. You ain't even paying attention to the the tiny writing at the bottom. They're all they got the they got their show, man. He's all dancing in front of the camera. Acting dumb and shit, and y'all are all like, mm. missing, missing all of it, missing everything. But I've watched y'all. I've watched the American people. I have watched y'all. Y'all love the look of things. That's why America's fake. We like fake shit. Y'all like the look of things. The look of things is what's important to you. As long as things look like they're on the up and up, it doesn't matter if they're on the up and up. That's what y'all think. 
as long as they look like they're on the up and up, it doesn't really matter if they actually are on the up and up. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I watched y'all be in love with Obama. I'm not any president supporter. I don't support Trump, I don't support Obama, I didn't support any president, because all presidents lie. I don't care how many times Trump has lied, they all lie. They all fucking lie. Some just do it way better. They just do it way better, and you're so distracted by, you know, the, the relationship goals, or, or seeing yourself in the fucking White House, or whatever. You don't care what they do. They'll do no wrong. When you love a president, they do no wrong. But when you hate the president, oh my God, y'all are on everything he does. Jesus Christ, y'all are on, y'all are on, on how they wipe their ass. <laughs> Isn't it funny? Do y'all even know who Monsanto is? Do you even understand how large of a conglomerate Monsanto is? The GMOs and how they convince us GMOs are good for us? Hmm? I could be wrong, but when I watch a documentary on how these GMOs are made, and the reason why GMOs are made is because they want to make them resistant to nature, okay? GMOs are resistant to nature, meaning that they do not attract bugs. They made the Roundup, took the Roundup DNA, and made a new seed, okay? They made a new seed for food. They took the Roundup DNA and put it inside the seed in this GMO, and that's what keeps the bugs off the food because it already has the Roundup in its DNA. They've showed you pictures of putting out GMOs and organic foods. And the animals ate the organic food and left the GMO alone. Even they know. Okay? Now, how did a company that makes poison become such a, a, a monopoly around the world how do they also become the leaders and makers of food but nobody cares about that right we love the last president we slept for eight years even though all them monsanto motherfuckers were in the white house all those competent people oh well at least he had competent people well yeah when you take care of the rich together you just getting the rich richer why are you gonna put a Monsanto, ex-Monsanto employee, the head of our FDA, food and drug safety, a head, Mons you know, an ex-Monsanto employee is the head of our FDA last administration. What else happened last administration? How else did Monsanto get further? Well, Mr. Obama had a great idea of taking Monsanto to Africa. Yes. Take Monsanto to Africa because we need to feed all the starving Africans, right? And that's what they do it under the guise, right? We're feeding everybody. To this day, African farmers are boycotting Monsanto in Africa. They are taking over their crops and the crops quality sucks. Look it up. This, I'm not talking about conspiracy theories. These are facts. Look them up. You don't have to take my word for it. I know, I'm just stupid with fake titties. What did my fake titties tell me today? This is what they told me today. Oh yeah. Don't pay attention, don't care. But who, who merged together? Monsanto and Bear? And now, now they, they run in things? Monsanto and Bear Company. That's the truth. That, those are facts. Not making shit up. That's right, Jay. Money, money, money. They take care of each other in the guise of caring about you. And then you want to tell me I'm crazy because I don't want to choose or participate in this fucking system. Even though I understand I work, I pay taxes, I'm already in the system. But as of choosing a leader, you want me to choose between two pieces of shit while they tell you one is different from the other when they aren't. You want to convince me that I'm stupid. Oh, you're just naked and dumb. And I'm not stupid. I see clearly. I see exactly. It's you who wants to choose a side and try to tell me what's better and tell me I'm the problem because I don't choose. 
The problem is you eat it up. You eat it up and you fucking believe it. Whichever side you're on. You can't step back and be even objective to see the whole fucking bullshit going on? Are you kidding me? And I'm the one that's high? <laughs>